Now this video is to demonstrate you how we calculate the amniotic fluid volume. This line is uh, the linea alba. You see, so you can see a dark line over here. This dark line. This is linea alba. And here I have placed a marker for that. I have uh, divided the, uh, the region of this uh, abdomen from umbilicus to the symphysis into four parts, making uh, I do I have drawn a line horizontally and uh, sorry horizontally and vertically. This is the vertical line. This is the horizontal line. Now it is dividing the uh, uh, this part into four areas: right upper quadrant, left lower quadrant. Sorry, right lower quadrant, left upper quadrant, left lower quadrant. This area. Now. We will scan in this region and get the largest pocket in vertical. We will scan then in this area, uh, on the left, uh, left side, then the right lower, then left lower. And we will get the vertical maximum amniotic fluid volume. And then we will calcul uh, add up all of these. And then we will see whether if, uh, uh, what we get, that, uh, what is the uh, range. Now, from 5 to 18 will be considered as normal. Less than 5 is uh, 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 it, uh, goes in the definition of oligohydramnios, but more than 18 or say 20 will be uh, suggestive of oligohydramnios. Now, let's do the C on the ultrasound. What do we get? First on the right, now I am going to scan first of all on, uh, on the right upper quadrant of this area, of this marked line. Let me play some gel. Okay, here we go. Now this is the right upper quadrant that I am showing you. I am going to take one measurement of the largest amniotic fluid pocket from here now I am going towards the left upper quadrant and uh, from here I will get the maximum. Uh, okay, now this is the maximum amniotic fluid volume that I can see in this left upper quadrant. Now I am going to measure it and then keep a record of it. This pocket is approximately 9.2 centimeters or 92 and the other one is 77.8. Now, if we recall, I'm going to save it. Now I'm going to go down. Down means into the right lower quadrant and get the amniotic fluid volume in that region. Now this is the right lower quadrant. This is the maximum. This is the left lower quadrant where I am going to uh, measure the amniotic fluid in vertical where I get the maximum. Here we are. So, this measurement is 5.52 or 55.2, and this is 54 gatwood. Now, this is uh, the second one is 56.1. So now we have uh, got the four uh, measurements. We are going to, if we add them together, so we, it will be 55. Plus 5.4, and then I stored the first one.
well, which is 55.4 single pair. Yeah. 55 plus 54. Do it. Karun Aja. No. Yeah. 92 plus plus 9.2. Sorry, you have to wait for a while because I, I am calculating 9.2 plus 7.7. Uh, so the volume which we get is 27.8. Uh, so it's more than 20 and now this is inconsistent with polyhydramnios. More than 18 is considered to be uh, above norm, uh, up to 20 is okay, or eight, you can say up to 18 is okay. Now this is going even more than 20. So this is how we get the amniotic fluid index. Thank you very much.